educate, eradicate. Today, I stand before you to address one huge concern that has not been talked about often in our society, teenage pregnancy. If you have not noticed it yet, the rising cases of early pregnancy in our time has become evident. Because of this, I would say that we are approaching a generation of young mothers. Why? As it is fueled by the lack of awareness in sex education and the neglection of teenagers. First of all, let's face the truth. We are witnessing the rise of young mothers as time passes. One of the reasons of this is because the insufficient awareness of sex education among the youth. The lack of knowledge has left many young individuals to navigate intimacy with someone without proper guidance. Yes, they may be aware of the basic biology of reproduction, but their nature of curiosity leads them into self-indulgence. As a society, we have that responsibility to ensure that our youth have the proper knowledge and understanding and good decision making. Moreover, it is not accurate to entirely say that teenagers are unaware of the consequences of unprotected sex, as others are aware but decides to ignore it. The reason may not be the lack of awareness, but rather because of making their own choice to continue it or not. Having this kind of choice may be an effect of taboos surrounding in our society and having that fear of judgment to others. As a result, teens decides to continue their decision without thinking about its possible consequences. To address this issue, I have three words I want you all to remember. Empower, educate, and eradicate. We can empower our youth to follow proper decisions in their lives through educating. Education acts as an important key for empowerment as it makes us aware of those things that we are unaware of. Educating young individuals in relationship and intimacy through inclusive education programs will eradicate or help lower the cases of teenage pregnancy. Eradicating the neglect of information when it comes to unprotected sex will make them realize the consequences of it. By fostering an environment that encourages open dialogue without judgment will surely help the deduction or decreasing of cases. In the face of the rising generation of young mothers, it is important to remember and apply those three words as it will not only help our current generation to improve, but it will also most likely do to be passed to our future generations, addressing the, approach, the approaching generation of young mothers.